Hello and welcome back to Square B Lux, where we talk all things spiritual and ways to enrich our lives and the spirit, man. So this, um, we will be talking about the third watch, which is the breaking of day watch from 12 a.m. to 3 a.m. This is one of the most important out of the prayer watches. The third prayer watch and the fourth um, prayer watch are the most important prayer watches to me. But on this one particular, the third prayer watch is important because, let me get into this before I start reading. This is important to me because this is the time when the witches and the warlocks are busy. 12 a.m. and up, that's when they start their work. Because we are most vulnerable when we're asleep. Because we're not we're not up thinking about, you know, fighting in the spirit realm. We're tired. We're sleepy. But it's important that if you're awakened at this time, from 12 a.m. to 3, it's important um, to wake up and pray and intercede on your behalf. You know, so... This is important, really important. I can't stress it enough. And I know you might like, you might be like, oh my gosh, I don't feel like getting up and praying and fighting. I'm tired of fighting, but you must get up and pray. It's vital. It's very important. Okay, so this is the period of much spiritual activity. This watch hour will strengthen your faith. Okay, this is also the witching hour. This watch is the darkest and most demonic part of the night, especially at midnight. Witches and warlocks have fun and start their incantations during this part of the night. Excuse me, the devil operates at this time because this is a time that men are in a deep sleep and there are not as many people praying to oppose him. This watch calls for seasoned intercessors. And I'm just reading that. You don't have to be seasoned. You just need to get up and pray. Okay. You must not be afraid of witchcraft during this watch. The Lord has given us dominion and authority over all things. This watch is geared for those who already know how to use their spiritual armor and war against the enemy. But it's okay if you're, you don't know exactly what to do because you keep watching this channel. You're going to be ready. You, you're going to be a warrior, okay? <laughs> this is the time to pray against satanic attacks on your life, family members, marriages, churches, and communities. We are most vulnerable to the devil's attack because at this time we are asleep. Declare Psalms 91 for divine protection for your family, yourself, church, city, and nation. Um, Psalms 91 is just it's good for protection just all around. That's a good Psalms for protection. This is the time to set your day before it begins. This is a powerful watch to be on when commanding the morning and setting things in place before the devil and his demons have a chance to ruin it. Plane crashes, car crashes, deaths, job loss, and many other acts of the devil can be stopped during this watch when intercessors obey the voice of the Lord and saturate this time with powerful spirit-led prayers. Okay? This is time for spiritual warfare. This is a time to awake out of sleep and confront every storm of destruction and distraction that is robbing you of God's blessing and provisions on your life. Also, it is a time to speak peace and calm into every situation of turbulence and confusion. This is a time to strengthen yourself spiritually and seek direction. Be vigilant. That's important to be vigilant during this time and watch for God's revelation and breakthrough and for his plans and purpose for your life and territory. Okay. Dreams flow during this hour. Often we are awakened during this time with dreams God has given us. God uses dreams and visions to bring instruction and counsel to us as we sleep. He also reveals areas where we need to concentrate our prayers and intercessions. Okay. And also remember that the devil can also attack you in dreams, nightmares. So 
So always pray before you go to sleep and ask God to keep you from the enemy's devices. So y'all, it is important to wake up. If you're awakening during this time, wake up and intercede on your behalf. Half of the time, you might not even know what you're praying against, but get up and pray. Um, because I'm awakening a lot during this time. But I know what I'm being awakened for. You know, it's people are working. They working, and I'm working too. Okay? <laughs> I'm not playing. <laughs> I'm, I'm not playing. Um, so yeah, and it's been plenty of nights where I'm laying there and I'm like, oh my gosh, I don't want to get up. Like, yeah, you, you're going to get tired of fighting, but you have to keep fighting. You can't let them win, um, because they're not stopping. So you have to keep going. And I'll make sure that I put the prayer decree in the description box to, below that you're supposed to pray at that time. At, that, at this particular time. So I hope that you found this information helpful. And as always, stay blessed and highly favored. And until next.